All right, so this is how to set up your tablet for first time use. All right, so straight out the box for the um, Tab A or other Android devices or tablets. All right, first of all, you're going to choose your um, language. So um, you should see the screen after pouring up your device. So go ahead and choose your language. Um, you might not recognize the language, so go ahead and tap. Search through until you find your um, language. It's in alphabetical order. For me, it's English United States. I'm going to hit OK. And of course, you're going to hit OK. Next from here. Um, you're going to hit the next arrow. Alright, from here, it says check out some info to get started. You're going to read the um, end user licensing agreements, your privacy policy, and um, your diagnostic data and so on. So, um, for the optional ones, you don't have to agree to them, especially sending diagnostic data. And of course, um, recipient of marketing information. Those are two are optional. You can say I've um, read and agreed to them all of the above. Um, but for me, I'm just going to selectively select the end user agreement, the privacy policy, and I'm going to leave out the diagnostic information um, and about uh, marketing information. All right, so I'm going to hit um, next. Here it says um, to bring your old data over. This is a brand new device. So I'm going to say skip for now. I'm going to hit next. And of course, here it's asking me to use my Wi-Fi to do some setup. This is the initial connection, so for now I'm not going to do that, so I'm going to skip this for now. So I'm going to hit skip. So it's just a second. It gives me this date and time. I'm going to set today's date and time as of making this video, which is um, December. Alright, so we're going to go all the way up to December 2020 over November December and it's the 18th today I think Friday so I'm gonna hit OK and of course here we go and the time is I'll set the time so I'm gonna hit next and of course here it goes it says to use Google services and so on and I use your location data and all that um, you can hit more here just simply accept or you can uncheck what you don't want for the optional ones. Asking you to enter your password or a PIN. In this case, I'm just going to set up mine. All right, I've chosen password. Seeing a password is more secure than a PIN. I'm going to enter it off screen. Once I've entered the password, I'm going to hit continue. It's going to ask me to confirm the password. All right, so I've entered the password for a second time. To confirm, this time it says OK. I'm going to hit OK. All right, so it's get recommended apps doing its thing. Of course, it's asking me to sign into my account. These can be done later on. You don't have to do these right away. For me, I like to skip them for the first time. Skip. Gives you a bunch of stuff. Don't have to sign into anything right away. Skip. And it says all done. Hit finish. All right, there you go. And of course, it's doing its thing. And this is the first time set up. As you can see, your device is now ready to use and you're all good. Um, when you click on certain apps, such as the Play Store, it will prompt you to log into your Google account. Likewise, for the Galaxy Store and all the other stores. So you don't really have to worry about um, signing into any account. I recommend that right away you do your um, Google account as it does protect your um, device in case somebody were to take it and try to reset it and so on. All right, guys. So that's how to set up your... Um, Tab A for the first time use. Sorry guys, Ricardo Gardner as always from Blog Tech Tips. Same bye until next time. Bye.